Hello everyone, this is Moses from Zatar Gardens. I'm going to show you something really quick uh, if you're experiencing this problem. Now, I have never experienced this problem. It's been about almost 10 years ago that I experienced a problem like this. And I think it's due to our cooler weather we've been having here in Central California, Zone 9B. And a lot of rain. The rain won't stop. It's like every other day it's raining and tonight and the, tomorrow and the next day it's going to rain. So... Rain is good, but if it rains too often, too close together when you're gardening, especially when new growth is coming out, you get problems. Fire blight, insect issues, other disease, powdery mildew, um, things like that. You'll get problems. But of course, we need the rain. The, the fresh water is outweighs the problems. But I'm going to show you right now. This is the Flavor Grenade Pluot. I love this tree. You can see the all the fruit let me show you all the fruit how it hangs see all of it but i saw this curled up leaves 100 percent. i said to myself this must be the what do they call it the curling leaf because we don't you don't get peach leaf curl on this or you may i don't know but it's not that peach leaf curls caused by a fungus this is called caused by an aphid and the aphids are making a nest or living inside the curl so if you spray this with pesticide organic or synthetic uh, it may not even do anything but you gotta remember nature takes care of everything in order for there to be predators or beneficial insects in the world there has to be food for them so there has to be infestations of some sort sometimes or the ladybugs and what do they call them? Lace wings and other things like that will die off. Praying mantis will die off. Well, look what I found right there. And mating, of course. Or they were. I don't know what they're doing now. Probably smoking a cigarette. <laughs> but anyways, so not only were they here, like I freaked out because every, almost every new tip is doing that, is curling. You can see right here. And I, I was freaking out. I go, no way. Look at all that fruit. No way. This is, I thought I did something wrong. I thought I, maybe I, I put fish emulsion and seaweed during the middle of the day. It, like I burned the leaves when the sun was out. And I was thinking, I don't do that. And all this stuff goes through your mind. But when you see this, oh, and there's another one. You see all that? They're your bodyguards. They're here to help you. This is their food. And now they're going to lay eggs somewhere here. And you're going to see those alligators. I don't know what you call them. The ladybug larvae. They look like alligators. And they will devour everything. So let nature be. I mean, there is a lot of fruit on there. I'll show you another angle. See what they could do with this aphid dust? Look at all the fruit. And now the fruit's not covered by any leaves. Then it clears up over here. They really only attack the new leaves. I want to have you guys. Happy gardening, everyone. Let's let these uh, two lovebirds alone. Bye.